Probably the most misunderstood torque specification on a vehicle is the oil filter. Hands down, it's not the lug nuts, it's not the head bolts, it is the torque specification for the oil filter. There is the old school oil filter. Some of these do have torque specifications in the service information, but pretty much you snug it up and then turn it three quarters of a turn to make sure that the seal is properly compressed and sealing to the block. For cartridge oil filters, well, this is another curveball because there's different materials and different filters and different vehicle manufacturers with different engines. Some manufacturers may use a plastic cap on these that have a torque specification of anything from 15 to 25 foot-pounds. It's critical that you look up the specification when replacing the filter. In some cases, some filter manufacturers, well, they put it on the side of the box. In some cases, like the dreaded Toyota V6, you have a cartridge oil filter but it's inside of an aluminum housing. This aluminum housing, well, in some cases it can gall and seize. In some cases, the technician who did the oil change before put a little bit too much torque on it. These aluminum housings have a torque specification of anywhere between 25 and 33 foot-pounds, and it's critical to tighten these to the proper specification. It doesn't matter if you're a senior technician or a rookie technician. You could be caught with a stuck oil filter when you're trying to remove it from some of these Toyota V6s. In some cases, well, it's the guy before you who installed the previous filter. Or it could be galling between the threads since this oil filter is not really in the best possible position underneath the vehicle. Just look at the square drive underneath and look at the size of some of the wrenches that you could use on some of these oil filters on these Toyota V6s. It is very easy for any technician to easily put 65, 70, or even 75 foot-pounds of torque on this housing. By using a torque wrench and tightening to the right specification, you're preventing damage to that housing. And most of all, you're gonna make that filter easy to get off for the next guy who has to service the vehicle. I'm Andrew Markell, thank you very much.